the big push is to have a hybrid fleet uh, with manned and unmanned uh, teaming. And the way you do that is by integrating different robotic systems into the tactical picture. But the, the RWs, they're sitting at the tactical edge right now that's defining what naval warfare uh, is evolving into. So the students for the past couple of weeks, they've been actively learning the, the basic foundations of robotics uh, over here at Carnegie Mellon University. Uh, so they started off with basic electricity, then they, they moved up to uh, principles of operation of a robotic system. That and, and this really correlates to all domains, whether it's surface, subsurface, air, and ground. This is unique because this is uh, all experimental over here at Carnegie Mellon University. But this is uh, the the results that they're gonna and they're producing from this experiment here is gonna help influence what the A school is gonna look like in the future. I found out about the rate, found it was pretty much everything I was looking for in a rate. Um, you're hands-on with technology, uh, you're working with the upcoming technology of the Navy, and that's really, really exciting for me. Moving through the entire course, I feel like would accurately reflect what we'll be doing throughout the fleet. And then even moving forwards, we focused on AI application for a while, and I see the fleet moving towards that. Uh, the people that excel in this rating are the people that are self-starters, uh, people that have a technical background and a, a genuine curiosity for wanting to learn and innovate and continue to uh, push the envelope of everything that, that gets pushed in front of them. You really feel the gravity of the situation that this is actually, this is the future of the Navy. This is what we're doing moving forward. And you're kind of planting that flag on the moon there where, where we're going in the future. Really incredible opportunity that I got to be a part of.